What's good, YouTube? So you read the thumbnail, right? I do not believe in diets. Stick with me through this video, and we're going to figure out why. But first, I need to clean myself up. Looking pretty darn rough. Okay, all cleaned up, feel much better. Now, as you read in the card, I do not believe in diets, and today is the first day of me actually doing some lifestyle changes. That's what I'm more of a fan of, because when you diet, you deny yourself things that you actually want, and then you end up having a bad day or an off week or go through something, then you go right back to where you started, and in most instances, you end up picking up more weight than what you originally started your diet with anyway. So, I don't plan on going on a diet per se, but I am going to make diet changes. I'm going to try to add things in that I already enjoy that are healthier and just do that more often and then do the bad stuff less often. Because I got, I got to tell you, I cannot not eat wings and pizza. I just can't. So diet changes so I can get results because I'm at the age where I can no longer outwork my diet. So I have to start doing other things other than just lifting because I'm in pretty good shape. I just carry a lot of extra. Now it's time for meal number one. So for the first one, we kept it simple. Some hard boiled eggs with a little bit of lemon pepper. Now, like I said, I'm not trying to go fully healthy. Um, that's pretty high in sodium, but I'd be okay. I love lemon pepper. A good old cutie's orange and some water flavored with um, crystal light black cherry lime. So it's much better than what I normally do for breakfast. I normally do like a Shipley's bagel, bacon, egg, and cheese bagel, or a McDonald's breakfast biscuit or something like that. So. We'll see how it goes. Plus, I'm a big fan of hard-boiled eggs and I like fruit, so it should be okay. All right, so I'm in the gym for workout number one. Um, I'm recording with my phone because I lost the charge to my camera, so I gotta wait on the new one to come in. But um, I'm gonna do a leg-back hybrid uh, because I missed legs yesterday. So I'm not looking forward to it, but workout one, time to sweat. <laughs> It looks like I'm gonna stay at 225 today. I'm right here bothering me when I'm in the hole. I can really feel it. I don't know what that is, so to be safe, I'm just gonna stay at 225 today. So, done with the main portion of the workout. Got my full body in with the squats, got my unilateral in with the overhead lunges. Now it's time for the finisher. I really don't feel like doing it. My legs feel like jelly already. And then I gotta throw in some back tube. So, in between my finisher, I'm just gonna do max effort pull ups. Uh, kind of a cheap back day, but at least I'll get some kind of blood flow through them. Let's finish up and ready to go. So, for today's finisher, it's kind of a, a 30 20 10 style workout. So it's 30 seconds of the first workout, 20 seconds of the second workout, then 10 reps on each leg of the third workout. So 30, 20, 10. I'm gonna try to do two rounds of this. It's a really good finisher for your legs and burn you up real nice, real fast. Try it at home sometime. Let's go. So, that was a 30-20-10, 30 second wall sit, 
20 second poster squat. That was the second thing y'all saw. And then single leg uh, hip thrust. So that's 30, 20, 10. Round one down, round two to go. Let's finish strong. All right, so workout one is complete. Ugh. Now I need to go find me something to eat. Keep the day rolling. Still got some trainers, but it look like it's gonna rain today. Bluetooth system Perry success. Sorry about that. That was my transmitter because I have an old truck, so I had to get a transmitter. But anyway, uh, like I said, it looks like it's about to rain, and if it rains, I'm gonna have to move all my sessions inside because my car doesn't do too good in the rain. It just really doesn't. I need two new tires. But first to some food, then we can keep it rolling. All right, so scratch the food. Um, I'm actually out at the field with my man Alden because he texted me and reminded me we were supposed to train at 10. So I had to turn around and come straight back over here. So I got workout two in already. As you can see, I'm sweaty from catching punts because my man has a big foot on him. He's going to be pro one day. Oh, yeah. But uh, we're about to do some conditioning now. Then I can get some food, and I guess later is workout three. Let's go. <laughs> Whew. Okay. Energy is kind of down today. I don't know why. I don't know if it's because, you know, I've eaten a lot less than I normally would have by this time. Um, when I don't have really a big appetite, but just a couple of eggs, you know, and a, a cutie's orange. It's not a lot. So maybe it's that. I don't know. Maybe it's placebo. Maybe it's all in my mind because I'm going to try to eat better and work out twice a day. But anyway, I still got the second workout, which is cardio-based. Fun, right? Yeah. Um, and then I got to find something to eat before that, though. I stopped at the store and grabbed a couple of healthier things. I grabbed some Nature Valley dry oat bars and um, some uh, string cheese. And those are two things I actually enjoy and I actually would snack on. And so I picked them up so I can grab those things instead of going and grabbing a Nutty Buddy bar or, or, or some ice cream or something like that, you know. So, like I said in the beginning, not trying to go on a diet, just make diet choices so that I can enjoy things like, spoiler alert, this big old soda. Yeah, um, since I got another workout, I figured I could work off some of that sugar because, again, I'm not going to deprive myself, um, deny myself, I'm sorry, of um, the things I enjoy. I'm just going to do it in moderation now. So relax for a second, workout two, then I got to try to keep this healthier eating up. Right, so it's time for workout number two, and I really don't know if this weather's going to hold up because it said it's supposed to storm today and tomorrow. So I'm going to do it right here at the house while I still have some uh, good weather left because the Clouds are actually blocking the sun pretty well, so I'm just going to, all right, when I say that sun start poking back out. But anyway, I'm going to do me a cardio workout here. I'm going to give me some jump rope, some uh, hand-eye coordination head ball boxing, and yeah, we're just going to go from there. So let me get everything set up and get ready to rumble. So I just realized that I've been recording this whole time, and the camera head fell over. That's crazy. I'm glad I messed up. I would have never noticed the camera, but having a hard time out here anyway because... Four boards are uneven, so the rope keeps catching and snagging and messing me up. What can you do other than keep pushing? <laughs> this thing here is really, really fun. It's hand out coordination. Uh, this ball is on kind of a bungee cable. Strap this around your head. Like I'm about to do. Uh, my hair is in the way. Gotta get it around all this hair. I already know when I pull this off, I'm about to take some hair off because my hair was definitely in the way. But anyway, give me a few minutes into this, and then I'm really gonna need some food. I'm tired, I'm gassed. <laughs> Workout two finished. I need a break. I should really be out here going small to get rid of all that right there. But anyway, good workout two. Now I definitely gotta eat. All right, finally sitting down for meal number two. And man, I'm ready for it. Like I said earlier, energy's been down. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the food or lack thereof. But here's what I'm having. As you can see, it's some kind of like 
summer style salad with almonds and strawberries and blueberries and all kinds of fruits and stuff. It looks very fresh and appetizing. Then we have a glass of water and some homemade salad dressing. It's pretty interesting looking, but it tastes better than it looks, I promise you. All right, so I just pulled up to my uh, next session and yeah, no one's here. And I was worried because I was running late. But anyway, that doesn't matter. Um, I am definitely glad I got that meal in me. I was dragging and that gave me life. Granted, my legs are already sore and I need to work out this morning, but that's neither here nor there. But I guess I'll just sit here and wait on my athlete to show up and uh, enjoy this nice, cloudy, windy day. Almost over. All right, so I'm finally home. And I want to say, y'all have seen me outside all day, all throughout this video. And y'all have seen in my previous videos how I talk about how crazy Arkansas weather can be. Well, I'm home. It's not even dark. Last time y'all saw me outside doing my outside workout was about two hours ago. Let's see what it's like now. All right, y'all. Let me tell you. Today's been a good one. Got both workouts in. Check. Been eating healthy all day. Well, healthier, check, and kind of a check because, you know, I have my Dr. Pepper from Sonic. But it's like I said in the thumbnail, and it's like I said at the start of this video, I'm not dieting because I don't believe in diets. I'm making diet changes, and that's what I think you should do, too, because when you diet, setting yourself up for failure, you're doing something that you're not going to sustain. It's not that you can't because bodybuilders prove it every day that they can do it. It's more of a matter of you don't want to. So why do you want to be so miserable unless it is to be a bodybuilder or something? So instead of dieting, make diet changes. And that's what I've been trying to do all day in this video. You know, of course, work out more, but also I want to put healthier things in my body so that my body can start reflecting the hard work that I'm putting into the gym. And, you know, just by making diet switches, I, I'm sure that's going to happen. Well, I know it's going to happen. And it's something that I can maintain. And I'm happy about that. So stick with me, folks. Day one in the books. I'm about to shower and relax. And I'll see y'all for day two tomorrow. Peace.